Ignatius D I A. What's up, bro? That's me, you guys. <laughs> that is me, Ignatius D I A. Back with the content. Sunbonani do milang up Shanila. What's popping? It is your boy Ignatius D I A. We're back in a building with another video, man. Yes, sir. Ah, oh, it's been a crazy minute. It's been a crazy minute. It's been a minute since we dropped the video, man. Um, but uh, I'm trying to get back into it after a whole lot of time going through some, you know, personal things. You know, kind of like taking a break off um, all this creativity stuff. Uh, I I don't want to lie. I did miss it. I did, you know, miss the setup, the recording. You know, all all this stuff. But. I just want to say to you guys that I am back now. I'm going to start uploading every single Sunday. I know I've said this before, but this time I just had to, you know, take a little break, um, have a little time to myself. And yeah, I did that and everything is kind of getting back to normal again. And yeah, man. So every Sunday, y'all stay tuned. I'll be up doing the things. Anyway, as I can see by the title of the video, man, um, this happened. This happened quite quite a long time ago a couple months back right uh, in september actually um we were launching well Akhanang fm studios were launching their new studios in in ika Heng. if you guys are familiar with poch of Strum, then you know what i'm talking about so i was invited there as the teacher of the band that you know i'm teaching to to perform you know to be the entertainment and that happened over the over the course of two days and we we performed both days it was, it was, it was quite a vibe um the following day the second day which is the the day that they allowed the community to get involved and you know check out the studios the first day was you know the the important people the people with the money you know you know they they're the ones that did like the grand opening they were the ones that were allowed to go in there and check everything out i mean i did end up getting in there because i mean come on now <laughs> but anyway yeah the second day we were allowed to actually go in there check out the facilities and i mean it's a vibe it's a vibe i was like damn i see myself being here one day but then i was like ah man maybe it's just one of those things just you know but yeah man it's, a, it's quite a vibe and yeah, as I was saying, as I can see by the title of the video, I actually ended up scoring myself uh, an interview. It was a short interview. It was quite vibey. I was able to walk in there, you know, just film, talk to the uh, was it a producer or what? Yeah, the guy that was running the show at that time. And he showed me a couple of things, you know, how royalties are paid out if your music is played on the radio. You know, all that stuff. It was quite vibey. And... It's a pretty chill job, you know. It's just that it's it's what would you like I would say it's a it's for upcoming artists. It's a so it's a the, the radio station is a community radio I don't know what I think it's called a community radio station. Um um like a development type thing. You get what I'm saying? So maybe for experience or so it's nothing that you I mean sure people would be there to People will go there to like settle down and everything. But for me personally, I would take it as a development type thing, like to build character and confidence and all that stuff. Then take my talent somewhere else. But I'm not passing any, you know, negative judgment to the people that actually work there because it's a vibe. It's hella, hella, hella vibey. But anyway, man. So yeah, I scored myself an interview and this thing has been chilling here literally this whole time. Uh, it's been waiting to be to be edited and like i said i was just going through a lot so i just decided you know what take a break and yeah so today i decided you know what let's just let's just record a video and just let the people know what's going on but yeah i'm gonna be back from now on new video coming up actually next week um yeah so please do stay tuned uh before we get into the interview do all the nice things please so like subscribe comment share you know do do all the nice things man share with your parents your family members your your brothers your sisters your uncles your aunts your your grandmothers your grandfathers everyone man it's for free all this stuff is for free so don't be stingy all that 
Uh, without wasting any more time, let's get into it. Yes, sir. Danko, 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 Danko. Kyo na sigarit larikin si Kiba Zinya Bariti Barona. But things by get little now. Who's Mamta Zilla Mabadabanti, Baliting Fa, Limuta Zilla, whom Pinot by Yoki Galona, Babona Telephone, the Papuza Castle, a third in Charona, it's a Arang FM, Falfamoroha, Sasa Hoba, Felali, Le Taganing, me, I take a Kiba Zinya, Bariti Barona, Luto Telephone, Horebone, a big humility, La Humpioni, Humpioni, Ele, Tati Ele, Tati Lamwa, Bo, Swaggy Simulega, Game, ladies. First, I Oh, yes, oh, yes, it's first. Melamba. I've entered the guy. The guy. Nakao. All right, bro. So, like, before we get into it, right? <laughs> I was hella, hella awkward. I won't lie. I was hella awkward. So, um, we got in there and I was with, I was with the band directors, um, should I say wife? I'm just, yeah, I'm going to say wife. I'm going to say wife. Ben Director's wife. And she went first. She went first with the interview because we went together. We went in together. I was a bit shy. I was a bit nervous, you know, doing it alone. So I asked her to come with me. I bet. So she went first. And then, cool. She did a thing. She did a thing. And then I was, I was then uh, being asked the questions after her. And man, all I was like so awkward. Like, it was like I've, I had never done this before. And the thing is, I had done this before. I have done this before. You get me? Um, how many times? Twice. No, once. I've done it once. I've done one interview. I've done one interview back uh, before in my life. And the other one was just, well, the other times was just like studio sessions at radio station. At a radio station. But, man, I was hella, hella awkward. But anyway, let's get back into it. Let's get back into it. I bet so like at this point we're doing like introductions and everything. Man's asking me about my bloodline and everything because you know just making sure that man was just making sure what he who's this bro? Where is he from? Because he's he's the different one out of everyone here. You know? Yeah. So man was just making sure who's this cool ass nigga in the building amongst you know all these people from Poch or whatever this town is. But anyway, yeah man, let's carry on. Let's get into it. Mm-hmm. Hey. Hey. The facilities they are very beautiful. Uh, I will not lie. Mm-hmm. from Yeah. It's it's an achievement. Yeah. It's it's a beyond category actually. Mm. So get a bit get a bit of for the community because like Antibabu yeah. this whole thing it's not possible without the community. Yeah. At the same time, eh but to wash it some more, but to buy into a rebel person will go fail. Libo and I give a family say it's a go fail. So yeah. Yeah, come to believe somebody about the bone by the propaganda gaffant like a fall. Scabale by the motor home. Scaba motorella camera. But the rabbi eat the world down and now the motor. Yeah, I can see like a muswavil in it. Yeah, next, next, next. I eat. What thing? What thing? What thing? We did this who will be telling the lava. I got only me say. First of all, shout out to God because God made all of this possible. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Number two, my mom, Mesima Putuma, Mutale Pule, Mesima Putuma, Frida Motswani, which is my girlfriend. Okay. Who is my girlfriend? Yes. Uh, Tate Mashati, Paul, mm. Paul Mashati. Yeah. Uh, uh, Ditos, yeah. Yeah, nah, he made all of this possible because he yeah. was coordinator in Togo. Yes. Um, my sister. Mm. My sister was always behind the scenes. She's my, actually my twin sister. Mm-hmm. Uh, we do my little Ignatia Maputuma, a one supporter in all sorts of ways. Yeah. So I would just like to say thank you so much to everyone that mm-hmm. has made my life possible. When mm. uh, you Marimba? Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. and now we Marimba. So now, as part of Marimba, Marimba Bendi, I am a Marimba Melodica. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but mainly kira ke jala di tra. Oh, jala di tra. Yeah. Tra me ki ki khona le ke bone engwe e telle yana ne. E ke maplanka fela. Maplanka. Ndi bitswa yeo. E o ke marimba e. Oh, ke marimba. Yeah, very different key. 
Thank you, Hotman. Never again. That's my job. But guys, that's been it. Thank you so much. And there you have it, foe. There you have it, man. So yeah. Um, it was a short one, you know. But before all of this, I was actually there was two, there's two other people doing the interview, and I was chilling in there, uh, just like taking videos and you know acting cool, you know all that. But yeah, one thing I actually need to clarify, and you know, just not get in trouble with the with the people with the money. <laughs> it's that when I said. Uh, Titos, Titos is um, he's the band manager, right? When I said he's the one that made it possible, I meant like with the with the band arrangements, and if he's the one that's like arranging everything for the band, not for the radio station. He works with us with the band, not the radio station. But um, I mentioned Paul Braubach Smashate. He works at the radio station, so you could say he he was doing the most on both sides with the band and the radio station. But yeah, man. It was pretty cool. It was hella hella vibey because it was a weekend there and uh, the heritage weekend. It got, so that's where I was. Um, where was I there? Oh, I wasn't at work on that Friday. I had excused myself. I asked to be excused. And then the Saturday we went back again. You know, it was all um, traditional clothing and all that. I don't think I still have videos of that day. But it was hella, it was hella hella vibey. Um, that's when my girlfriend pulled through on the Saturday. The Friday she was still at work, so she pulled through on on, on the Saturday. And yeah, man, we, we ended up chilling there literally the whole day until 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 <laughs> yeah. And yeah, folks, it's been it. It's been it. I hope you guys like this video. I hope you guys enjoy this video, man. And I hope we're gonna get you know some more surprise interviews or unplanned interviews in the future i mean sure that's i'm i'm 100 sure we're gonna be you're gonna be blah, 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 we're, gonna, blah, 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 we're gonna be getting those i'm sorry for that <laughs> i'm sure you're gonna be getting those that's 100 percent sure with the line of work that i'm doing i do enjoy this i do enjoy this kind of stuff so it's it's in the same same line same field you get me but anyway without wasting your time any further man thank you so much for tuning into the video um i hope you guys really liked it do please comment share like subscribe all the nice things man tell your grandmother your grandfather your sister your brother your mom's your dad your aunt your uncle you know tell them that ignatius di is back man and thank you so much for tuning in man i'll see you guys next week Sunday with another ignatius di sunday special yes sir watch the trailer after this meat i love meat bro i love my meat pause not like that you know what i mean though i love yes i love meat the food <laughs> i love i love meat it was stuck going in with the meat i stuck going in and damn Ooh. Clever guys. like i literally start choking on on a piece of meat now girls now understand what y'all be going through man